After our hurdle drills and our running drills, there are three other things that we can do to help with hip mobility. The first one we're going to go over is bounding, which you may recognize from our dynamic warm-up. With the bounding, we're just going to start off with Vanessa taking a small step and then using an exaggerated running form to complete the path down. With this, we're emphasizing the forward, not the up or out to the side, trying to open the length of the stride. Brody's going to demonstrate using an even longer step because he has longer legs. With that, we want to make sure that the athlete is doing, going to their individual potential um, and crossing the space almost as quickly as they can without actually sprinting. Next up, we have the lunge lizard. This is another one that you may recognize from our dynamic warm-up. With this, we're going to have Vanessa lunge out with one to get in this position. Then she's going to lower down using whichever arm matches the lead leg, wrapping it inside. She's then going to alternate to the next leg using the other arm to wrap in between. Now with this, I want you to notice as Brody starts, that as he goes down, he's emphasizing pushing his hips into the ground or towards there and stepping straight out of it. With this, we're opening up the hip flexors on the back leg as well as the glutes, hamstrings, and IT band on the lead leg. Our last hip mobility exercise that we're going to show you is called the duck walk. Vanessa is going to show us an intro level. Um, she's going to first squat down, staying on her power pads or the balls of her feet, and then she's going to take small alternating steps forward. With this, if the athlete can't get down that low or can't take long steps, we want them just to do as best they can. With this, we're emphasizing the, how low they get as well as the length of their steps. So with Brody, we're now going to see a little bit of a longer duck walk step. With this, he's still staying low. His hips aren't changing a lot of height. And he's lengthened his step to help open those hips some more. Thank you for joining us for the hip mobility section of the North Oak Stretching Series.